Hello, fellow engineers. Uh, there's a... Well, I say there's a brand new pack. There's not a brand new pack. It says new puppy pack. It's, there always was a puppy pack. It was just rubbish. But uh, there's a new pack. So we're going to be we're gonna be doing that today. Um, loads of change. I don't actually understand. Like, like, yes, there's a new pack. Why change the original animals? Like, just get a new pack. I don't, I don't know. I don't like that they keep changing, like, old stuff. Because, like, the ants changed. The beavers changed. What does the beaver do now? It doesn't give health, but it now gives attack. Like, how random. Anyway. Anyway. Uh, loads and loads of change. Like, so many animals have been changed. Um, so we're gonna, we're gonna do a, a little bit of this. It'll be, see what's going on. Am I a billionaire? Uh, depends what game you're talking about. Not in Super Auto Pets. Um, so yeah, I've got the, I've got the puppy pack done. Let's go into Arena and see what it's all about. Um, yes, 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 a key bolt. <laughs> I will never see your name right. <laughs> it's been 14 months. I've never got it right. Um, right, so what we've got here, we, we know what the duck does. That gives shop pets one health. we got the moth. Start of battle, give front most friend two attack. Oh, that's not bad. Start of battle if you have a toy. Oh, yeah. So there's now toys. Um, I believe you need to get an animal that, like, gives you a toy, if that makes sense. But a toy is like a... It goes up there. It's sort of like an additional item that sort of... I think it helps you either every round or every other round or something. Yeah, PPP. <laughs> PPP. PPP. <laughs> PPE on all these, all the animals. Uh, safety first. Isn't that right, Mr. Duck? Um, Covain, cheers for the sub. Give Paddy an extra pet from chat. Will do. He's downstairs at the moment. I just gave him a treat. So he's working his way through that. Uh, five hands. Yo, he says. Uh, cheers for the sub. Right, what are we going to do then? I'm quite tempted by the gecko, if I'm honest. Two health. I need to get a toy. Actually, let's have a look at pets. So turn one. I need to look at the ones that I don't know. Do any of these give a toy? No, no. Okay, okay, that one gives a toy. That gives a toy. So I feel like that would be good if I had a toy. But I don't have a toy. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, let's, I don't know, let's go with that anyway. We'll give it some attack. And then... Should I shove a duck in for now? I like a duck. We'll roll. Oh, there you go. Two more ducks. Freeze those. Didn't get the toy this time. So we'll see what happens maybe next round. There will be the milky socks. <laughs> Flashback to teenage years. Um, thank you to Artie for the sub. Gonna play with us today? Yeah, we can. We can do some verses. I really don't know much about like these pets though. So I'll probably get rinsed and then it'll be like a short round. But we could. We could. Kubi Luffy, cheers for the sub. 16 months. Yeah, Mr. Boyata. Love you too, buddy. Cheers for the sub. All right, let's get the ducks in. So, duck gang. Are we on? We're not on tier two yet. Oh, look, there's the ferret. So, that gets us the, the level one toy. So, I reckon stack a duck, shove the ferret in. So, this is the new one. So choose toy, it breaks after two turns. You can get a balloon. So at the so when it breaks, our rightmost friend gets one and one. Not bad, actually. Or start a battle, deal one attack to two random enemies. So I guess that does that every time. Whereas this will be like a permanent attack. I might go with the balloon as it's permanent. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep any of these that long, though. So I've got two turns to decide what to do. We're going to freeze you for now because I assume that's going to get two health at the start of the round. Plus two attack from the moth. Oh, this could be a big, big old boy. So the milky socks versus the salty suspects. So ooh, that's a big whatever that is. Thankfully. Oh, no, we get a millard. We get a millard. Are we okay? It's a draw. We'll take a draw. Balloon's better early on, is it? 
Nice. Ooh, we have a question. Is there any simulator games? Uh, just re-watching your lawnmower videos. Love every single moment of that. Well, there's... In my playlist, there is a simulation game playlist. So that could be very handy for you. Um, right, I'm gonna... Let's get a tier 3 pet. Oh, we get... What the? We get to pick? Does that mean we get to pick? Or do we get both? I think we just get to pick, do we? Um, what have we got? Mole. Faint. Remove the three nearest enemy perks to summon 188 mole. Blooming hell. That's strong. Um, goldfish. Enter and increase cell value by one. Max gold is 30. Oh, so that could be... That's like a long-term investment sort of pet. Or like you just want to sell it. Or do I go... I might go with the mole. See how the mole works. So then... Yeah, should I sell that duck? Then take the mole. I'm going to have to... That's the only trouble with the mole. I'm going to have to try and get, like, some decent stuff. Because it take What does it do? Remove the three nearest perks. So presumably that's, like, not like an apple, but like a garlic or something that you can actually shove on it. And I can probably get rid of the ferret as well. Let's just have a look. What does that do? Faint. Oh, that's good. Is it? It's got stats. Break friendly tier two or lower toy. Oh, so that will trigger that this turn. Oh, only when it faints. Oh, so will that do it in battle? That's like stats in battle, isn't it? Oh, what's that? What's that rice? Give one give one pet the rice perk. Sell for plus two gold. Oh, so that's exactly what we need for the mole. So we basically need three, like three of those things on different pets. Oh man, this is gonna be this is actually gonna be complicated. Um I might Oh, I don't know what to do. I'm gonna sell the ferret. I'm gonna grab you. I'm gonna shove you at the front. And then I'm gonna shove rice on one of you. So then I just need two more rices and then the mole will work. And that's an eight eight pet. Which is really good this early on, surely. Um, so both of those should get two health. Yeah, that's good. And the mole should get four attack. So that'll be that'll be a six five going in. So let's give that a bash. I have no clue what's going on either, don't worry. <laughs> this they're all new pets to me. So there's the mole. So what are we facing? Oh, what's that flying screw? Friendly toy break. Resummon it. Okay, I need a scroll. I need a scroll. We got absolutely rinsed by that team. Shafted. Um, Squessy. Good evening. Cheers. Cheers for the sub. Very kind of you. Koopy Luffy. Giving out five subs. Thank you so much. Super generous of you. Uh, that's just Doran. I'm not addicted. No. There's a new update. So I'm allowed to play it. That's how this works. Um... Ah, uh, Mr. Bassman. Or Bassman. If he's into fish. Uh, cheers for the sub, very kind. Right, so the lemur. That's a new toy. So I need a toy for those two to do their thing. So I reckon stack you two. Hang on, what, what do these do first? Faint. Summon a 2-3 dolphin with rice in the back. What? <laughs> So random. Uh, <laughs> that's so random. Why is a dolphin eating ice? You got nothing to do with each other. Anyway, ferret by. Oh, okay, so that's a level one toy. No, a tier one toy. That's a tier two toy. Oh, what's a tier two toy do? Let's have a look. So, what have we got? Radio break. Give all friends plus one. Not bad. Garlic press. Give the right most friend garlic. Oh, start a battle. Okay, so that's a free garlic. Which could be good. But I don't want it to go to the rightmost friend. Because I think that says remove the three nearest enemy perks when it faints. So basically, the animals behind that have to have it. 
They can't be in front because otherwise they'll be dead. That's right, isn't it? So essentially, let's just go. Let's go radio then because it's stats. Let's give meat bone to. I don't know that thing. I'm probably going to sell the lemur. Oh, look, there's a gecko. There's a gecko. Okay, I think. Let's freeze. I got one more roll. Okay, we didn't get we didn't get what we wanted. Let's get rid of the lemur. Let's shove you in. We don't we won't be able to trigger the mole this time. Next time though, I think we will. I think that's how it works. I think. I actually have no idea. Uh Kiep. 33. You are awesome. Continue the great content. Thank you. Thank you for the sub. Very kind of you. Um, and then we have a question from Koopy Luffy. Hang on, are we going to win this battle? Or oh, it's going to be tight. We won because the meat bone. Now when will we see more Timberborn? There is Timberborn on the way. Let me just have a look in my, in my calendar. In my schedule. Timberborn is out on Wednesday. Or maybe it might be out tomorrow. Depending on if the thumbnail gets done. But probably Wednesday, you Timberborn. Don't worry, there's always Timberborn in the works. It's just, oh, there's the flying squirrel. Friendly toy break, resummon it. Oh, and gain one attack. But I think just resummoning is the best. It means you'd never lose a toy. Essentially. Um, cool. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> I get excited because I think we can do what we wanted to do. Although we're about to level up all these pets. Do I actually want to do that? Oh, because now I want these. So faint. Give chili perk to the nearest friend behind. Chili's pretty good. Uh, lobster. Friend summoned. If outside battle, give it two and two. Uh. Okay. Shall I stack the geckos as well? Should probably do that. I think I definitely want to get the flying squirrel in, don't I? And then if I give the flying squirrel meat bone, then that's the mole sorted. We've just gained an 8-8 eight, eight mole, I think. Pretty sure. So when that dies, it takes all of those. So they don't actually do anything, I think. I don't actually know. And then... This guy can give chili, but only once it faints. So I guess if that goes behind the mole, then someone will still get chili, right? And it should probably be that, because you're going to gain two health. Or maybe more when we level up. So yeah, let's freeze the mole. I think that's a pretty decent order. Oh, aren't they quite good? Give the nearest friend ahead four and four attack. Oh, Oh, I don't know what to do. I could get rid of the moth thing, but it's got it's got a thing on it now. Now I think we'll just we'll just keep this. We'll just we'll just keep going with that. I think everyone's gonna get plus one health next time as well from the toy thing. But uh, let's see what happens. So oh we oh there's the eight eight mole eight eight pretty beastie early on. Okay yeah I like this I like this this is going well. So yeah, we've lost the thing. Everyone got one health and then it came back because of the squirrel. So we've got constant one health for everyone every other round. I'm happy, essentially. Uh, so let's get the, the extra mole in. Probably the extra gecko. See what the level up is. Oh, it's a dog. A Doberman. If this is your lowest tier, it's not my lowest tier. It'll be my highest. Gain coconut and eight attack. Okay, well, that's pointless. Caterpillar. I have used Caterpillar before. Start of turn. Gain experience. I might just leave my team as it is. Because anything I buy, I'm going to have to give it more stuff in order to keep using the mole. So, yeah, let's... Oh, do I keep going or do I... Do I freeze a... Sal I might freeze a bolt. I'll do one cheeky roll. Oh, it's another gecko. Another gecko. What does that gain now? Four health. So I'm guessing it will gain six. 
Is six health that much? I mean, I guess so. Trying to get to level three is hard. Sod it. I'll do that. Unfreeze that. Let's go. We're going level three gecko. Scrap mechanic. Yeah, that's been suggested quite a lot. I did actually play it once, like off stream. And um, it's really hard to learn. Like, there's a lot to that game. It was quite, like, overwhelming. Yeah, it is a game for engineers. Engineers with time of how to... How things work. Now, what does a leveled up flying squirrel do? Where's flying squirrel? There it is. Uh, for any toy break, resummon it. Oh, it just gains more attack. Oh. Maybe flying squirrels aren't that good. Oh, cross on. I've seen that before. Gain one attack at the end of the turn. I think that's permanent. So, essentially, I'm better off swapping these things with the croissant. Because that means we do actually gain. Like, particularly the meat bone ones. They're pointless being at the back. Um, the question is, who do I actually want to swap? Am I going to sell the gecko at any point? Maybe not if I'm going for level 3. Um, oh, croissant is good. Flying Screw is better when you have the higher tier. So yeah, we'll keep that one, yeah? So I may as well just give it more attack. So yeah, let's level it up. What's the llama? If there's an empty space... No, there's not an empty space. No chance. Oh, llamas for days. Ooh, a puppy! Ooh, a tier three. Okay, so that's the, the tier three. I think we may as well... Can I look at... I can't look at the... Um... I want to see the toys. Where's the toys? I don't know what level or what tier three toys there are. I feel like this one's pretty good though. At least for now. Um, do I just roll? What does a raccoon do? Steal food from target. Meh. We got oh, we got another mole. Decent. Oh, what does a mole do? If that spawns an 8 8, it spawns a 16 16 mole. Okay, mole is pretty overpowered. Uh, oh, and there's another squirrel. That is what we're talking about. Oh, press on the puppy in the pet menu. Does it tell you what it does? I'll have a look after this. Wait, oh, there's so many stats going on. But yeah, we have we have a strong team now. We have a strong team. Okay, so radio gives everyone health and then it comes back thanks to the squirrel. Uh, so where's where's puppy? There it is. Oh, so oven mitts. Nice one. Who told me to do that, by the way? Press on the crash Saturn. Cheers, dude. Appreciated. So stock one lasagna or two lasagna. Oh, that's quite good because lasagna is two attack and three health. That ain't bad. And then toilet paper make the first enemy weak. Okay. So what's the... Oh, is it always the end? Okay, it's always the end one. So melon helmet. Give the rightmost friend melon, but only when it breaks. Foam sword. Deal six damage to the lowest health enemy. Is that every, every turn? That's quite good. No permanent stats on that one. Stingray. We've got flashlight. Give rightmost friend... Oh my goodness, six and six. Stinky sock, reduced health by 40%. Okay. Sting rate. Okay, yeah, so higher, higher, higher level things. Really good. Fair play. Right, so level up the mole. Boosh. Pick between a poodle and an eagle. Oh, intense by the poodle. Give one attack and one health to one friend of each tier. Whereas an eagle summons a 5-5. Five, five. That's good in battle. That's good outside of battle. I reckon sell the moth. Get the poodle to level up. Because what have we got? A tier 3, a tier 1, a tier 4, and another tier 3. Okay, two tier threes, but still, most people will get stats, I think. 
Hey, Labradog. How's it going? The trouble with selling that is I'm going to have to buy, like, a croissant to go on the poodle or something. Oh, I don't know, actually. Let's, uh... I'm going to put flying squirrel on just to see what the other choice is. Oh, there's a stingray. Okay, we sell the moth. Oh. Oh, I don't, oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Okay, we sell the moth. Get the stingray. And then we go with flash right. Right? Six and six attack. Surely. So that's that done. Then, do we sacrifice not having a 16-16 mole? Well, oh, I could just give the cross onto that. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Sorted. Do I freeze a poodle? This is like an old pack that's been renewed. So it's technically new. And I never played puppy, puppy pack, so it's completely new to me. But uh, basically, everything is new. That They change pretty much every animal. Added like toys and stuff. So very different. Um, so yeah, we got you at the back. That's going to spawn 1616. Do we freeze a poodle or do we just. Alleged dog lover. Oh, see, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> I just asked it again as well. Um, what do you think, chat? Freeze it or not? I don't think so. I'm going to wait. I'm going to see what chat says. Chat's got my back. Nah. Okay. Someone said nah. Yeah, everyone's saying no. Sorted. Okay, so here we go. Milky socks. Oh, they got a foam sword. Wasn't that six damage? To... Oh, no. He's down. No, that means the mole didn't work. Because there weren't three. Oh, no. There weren't three things, like, pet, what are they called? <laughs> Perks? Those things. Because he got fainted straight away. Oh, that's not ideal. Now, what does that do? Do attack damage directly back to whoever knocked this out. Uh, it could be good. What does that do, like, further up? Where is it? It does double attack damage, triple attack damage. That could actually be good. But it's only when it dies, so it's not going to rip through anyone. I think we definitely want to sell the sting, right? Don't think I want any of them. Let's roll. There's another poodle, which we could take. What else do we have at, like, tier 5? There's a lot There's a lot going on in here. So many new animals. I'm just going to wait and see what comes up. So that is toy from tier below, so don't care about that. Oh, what's a lemon? Uh, give one pet the lemon perk. Take seven less damage twice. Twice? That's quite good. But yeah, I can only give that to my mole. Because otherwise it will get eaten by the mole. So I can't really use that. Um, another flying squirrel. Which I don't... I don't think I want to level up the squirrel again. I think it's good enough. Um, they're all low tier. Where's all the good... Where's all the good pets? We're nearly out of pets. Game perk. Oh, game perk. And remove it. Oh, I don't know if that's good, actually. Probably not. Faint. If you have a toy, give nearest friend behind five health. That ain't bad with the flying squirrel. Hmm, could do that. Well, I, just, I roll three times for a decent tier five. Okay, what's that? Friend game perk. Give it permanent stats. Okay, not ideal. Oh, that could be good. I oh, know, because it's tier 2 or lower. That's annoying. It's got to be level 3 to pop this. Because basically that breaks the, the toy. And I think it happens like in battle. So if I had that like at the start. Oh, why did I just buy it? I didn't mean to buy it. <laughs> no. But if I had that at the start. What an idiot. Then uh, that would give 6 and 6 to itself. Uh, that is a fail, though. Massive fail. Um, that's not going to do anything. I may as well sell that. So now we've got to pick one of these. I guess we just do 
tropical fish, one health either side. Not ideal. Let's shove it. Ooh, did you hear that? We'll shove it there. That was an absolute fail, Matt, you knob. At least you got some permanent stats. The pink thing wouldn't have done anything because uh, I think it's like an in-battle sort of thing. But here we go. 1616 Molt did some damage. The chili is ripping through. It's a draw. We'll take a draw. Oh, it's not a draw because he had the blooming spawny thing at the end. I messed, I messed up that. Uh, chicken, faint. Give future shop pets permanent one attack and one health. Wait, every time it faints? So in battle, does it? Surely not. Surely not. That could be really good. Now, what's that salt? Give someone the salt. Attack lower tiers for double damage. That could be good on like... A tier 6, which I don't have. Um, let's get rid of the tropical fish. I feel like it's probably... We're on turn 10 already. I feel like chicken, you take it if you get it like as an early upgrade one. It's probably too late now. I'll probably just go poodle. Freezer poodle. Yeah, let's see what else we got. So chili... That could give two behind chili, I reckon. So we'll do that. Oh, we got chocolate as well. Shall we see if that's what it does? Because we get a tier six. So give chili perk to two nearest friends behind. Ah, oh, decent, decent. Oh, look, elephant seal. Give friends one attack and one health. Double in battle. So behind... Oh, yeah, behind that. Because that will get the chili, and then it will give the the friends behind one and well two and two each. So that's good. What does that do? The mantis shrimp deal ten damage to the first enemy. Oh, that's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. What's the bell thing on the right? This this is a flashlight. This is a toy. So essentially, every, like there, that number two. Every two rounds, that means. So every two rounds, that will give the rightmost friend six and six attack and health. Um, but it usually breaks, but I have the flying squirrel at the back, which says friendly toy break, resummon it. So that just keeps coming back every two turns. Usually it wouldn't. Uh, they're linked because now you have a choice. So because they just upgraded, we get to pick one of these that we want to keep. Um, I reckon elephant seal and you go there. So that gives chili to the two behind. So what it might be worth doing, sacrificing the chili on that and actually moving that there. No. Nah, nah, it's better doing that because then we actually use the two chilies rather than just one. Yeah, so unfreeze poodle. I think that's pretty good. We got more chocolate for next time. What does that do? Do friendly toy broke give adjacent pets three and three blooming oh <laughs> there's so much in this there's so much going on I don't know what's going on all right come on milky socks what we got the foamy believers yeah the trouble with doing the verses with you guys is I have no idea what any of these pets do so like the time will just run out all right here we go we got stats here we have stats on our side it's a draw it's a draw we'll take a draw Bob, 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 bob. Swap the gecko with the squirrel. Um, why would I do that? Why? Because at the moment, the gecko's gonna get the chili. So I want that to have more health. And because that gets. 8 plus 4. That's going to have way more health. So it might have more chili attacks, if that makes sense. That's why it's in front of the squirrel at the moment. Squirrel does more damage. Now, you don't want... That way, that your damage doesn't affect chili. 
Chili just does five damage to like the next enemy. So you want more health because then you got more chance of hitting more than once. If that makes sense. So yeah, we're staying there for now. We're staying there. Um, do I try and level up the mole? I feel like I should... I mean, I should probably melon you. Because that will give stats about... Oh, one and one for everyone. And then it will lose the melon, but it's only three attack. So I don't really care at this point. We'll roll. There's another melon. Oh, do I one and one it or do I... I should probably just give that guy the melon. It's 13 attack. Not, not too bad, is it? Right, ready? The saucy sack. Oh, what have they got? Oh, I gave peanuts. Did it give peanuts to the front? Oh, there's peanuts everywhere. Peanuts, that is. When this is on YouTube, peanuts. Oh, man. <laughs> we got done by peanuts. Peanuts. N-U-T-S at the end. Not N-I-S. Damn YouTube. Okay, so do you see that? The flashlight gave six and six to this guy. But then because we had the flying squirrel, it came back. So that's good. Um, next up, what? Puma? Friendly toy repeats. Oh, friendly toy repeats itself. So we'll get, we'll get 12 and 12. I got to get a Puma into this. I've got to get a Puma in here. I'm going to sacrifice the elephant seal, I think, for a Puma. Um, do I stat everyone up first? I don't need the Puma now. I could sell the Gecko. Yeah, that's true, actually. Gecko is pretty terrible. Sell the gecko, give the puma like croissant or something. I mean, whatever I give it, it's going to lose. So croissant is better. Yeah, let's sell that. Because then with the rice, we get extra coins. We've got 14 coins. So we do... I don't actually need to give it croissant, do I? Don't need to. Yeah, actually, I don't need to. I don't need to. So I'm not going to. I think I'll do that for now. And then, may as well do that. Bit of stats. Boosh. Then, oh, another mole. Another mole. Um, is there anything else that we like the look of? Not really. I guess we just roll. What do we have here? Oh, so they're the, that's the tier six pets. And can I click on that now? No, I can't. Got to be careful after earlier. So we click on the mongoose. So we can get a TV, which gives... Oh, that's good. That is good. Two and two. How do you get the higher level? Well, I guess you level up these, do you? Probably. So TV gives two and two to everyone. Or the peanut, which gives that peanut thing that we just saw, which is like a one-hit kill. Hmm, interesting. We've also got a pie. Give one friend the pie perk. Gain four and four. Not bad. Then lasagna, which is permanent stats. Um, what else we got in here? Eagle, seen that. We've seen you. Chameleon. Act Ooh. Activate friendly toy. There's no... There's no tier restriction on this one. Oh, that's actually really good. Aren't there... There's pills in this. With the puma. Oh, okay. I've I've just come up with an amazing idea. Chameleon and puma. That's going to be fat stats. That's 12 and 12 whenever I want. For the cost of four coins. Although I could do two and two to everyone. But yeah, that's... He has no point doing that one. I think this is better for now. Oh, it's four and four to everyone though, isn't it? There's only going to be three pets that I keep though. If I mongoose. Oh, there wasn't. There'll be four. So I'll sell that. Buy that. Sell that. Then buy that. Should I do it now? No, I can't do it now. 
I can't do it now because then the, the mole won't work. Okay, let's freeze Mongoose. And then we roll twice. So what does that do? Friend bought. Give me some gold. Oh, there's a pill. Oh, I missed the pill. Idiot. Not bad. We do have chocolate though. I might freeze that and get the big mole. Okay, right. I think, I think I know what's going on. I think. So, Boosh, you... Oh, we lost, we lost our melon. They've got the garlic press perk thing. What a knobhead still. Boosh, boosh. Okay, we got away with one there. I won't lie. But, uh, oh, there's the mole. Should I shove the mole in? Yeah, we'll shove the mole in. I was, oh, I was hoping for a for a puma, if I'm honest, so I could like level that up first. Because there's the pill that we need. So do I do this? The trouble is, I don't think we'll get the mole, and the mole is 24, 24. I might have to save that for next round again. So yeah, I think we just we just hold on to these and we try and level up. The Puma. So we're just rolling for a Puma or a... What's that do? Deal six damage to one random enemy after attack. Ooh, that's not bad. There you go. There's chocolate. Sorted. And there's that. Okay, nice. As long as we got the coins next time, we're going to be laughing. So. Oh, we got two lives. We can definitely make it to the next round. That's good. Wipe through you. There's the 24-24 mold. Beauty. Okay, we're in a strong place. We are in a strong place. So that was 12 and 12 to the mole there. That's quite a lot of stats. Um, but if we level up the Puma now. Then, oh, what is that? Deal four damage to one random enemy. Repeat for each ten attack this has. Is that good? I don't know. Anyway, distracted, distracted. We sell the seal. Then we... Do we do the mongoose? I think we do the mongoose. Goodbye, flashlight. We're going for... Oh, there's another one as well. Coconut pack. No, we're going for television. Give all friends two and two attack. Okay, then we sell the mongoose. Then we buy the chameleon. Then do we go down to a four-man team? Because what we're going to do, we're going to get... All friends are going to get two and two. But the puma repeats... Oh, no. Yeah, the puma makes the friendly toy repeat its ability as level two so oh man what does that do <laughs> what does that do as level two so it will give six and six to everyone that's insane that's actually really good i just need to like try and get more chameleons and sleeping pills so if we do that i've done this right right Oh, stats. Stats. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna roll for more chameleons and sleeping pills. I think that's all we need. That is all we need. What's that do? Oh, perks are two times stronger on this. Interesting. So a stake would would do 40 damage. Damn. Um no geckos or pills. Still, look at our stats. I think we're in a pretty good position. Although the mole is not going to spawn its thing. I need to give the puma something. Slightly annoying. Still, the mole is hench. It can probably look after itself. Like it is ripping through everyone. <laughs> nice. Yeah, this update is on mobile as well. I did check. Oh, pancakes. Give one pet the pancakes perks. Give all friends two and two before the start of battle. Nice. Um, oh, I'll tell you what. I should probably just give that to the Puma. 
Yeah, start battle. Okay, that's two and two for everyone. Decent. I just need chameleons and pills now. Oh man, there's chocolate. Do I try and level up the puma? That's too much, isn't it? That'll be too much, leveling up the puma. I think I've just got to I've just got to use this. I want to go for the win. I don't care about level threes at the moment. There's chameleon. I wonder as well, if I shove that at the start, then that will trigger that. Oh, everyone's going to get... Okay, I think... I think that's my team. I think that's my team, right? Because I can trigger that outside. But that will work in battle. So I think everyone's going to get six and six. Like after the first attack. So we'll see this guy get wiped out. And then what stats do we get? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's good. And when this mole gets knocked out, a 24-24 comes back in its place. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Okay, there goes the television. So everyone legit just got leveled up then. Decent. Let's try and level up the Puma again. I mean, if we take a pill, I probably will just take the pill. But, uh... Yeah, to be honest, let's just keep, keep rolling. We'll freeze chocolate, because that Puma is close. Why not level up the Chameleon? Oh, I could do that instead. Because then I don't need permanent stats. Because the stats in-game... Will everyone be 50-50? They won't be far off, will they? That is actually a shout. I don't know why I thought about destroying the chameleon. Oh, there's two chocolates, though. Oh, what do I do? <laughs> I could get level 3 Puma. It's turn 9. I think I want level 3 Puma, just so I've, like, got an achievement. Nice. Because if we get a win with that, then pat on the back for Matt, sort of thing. Um, there's another chameleon. It's, it, I hope I sort of hope we lose or draw, ideally. I think we're going to win, though. I can't see us not winning. Like, the amount of stats we're going to get. We got 50-50 up front. But I think most of my team is going to be 50-50. Oh, 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 oh. Did I get too cocky? No, I didn't get too cocky. We are fine. We are fine. Decent. We've got to win. We got Puma at one at max level. Well, yeah. Toys. Pre oh, yeah. The mole was max level as well. The toys. Pretty good. I like that. I'll tell you what. Now I'm confident. Let's do versus. <laughs> I'll destroy you all. Um, let's call this Cocky Matt. So if you want to join, we're using the brand new puppy pack. And uh, it's called Cocky Matt if you want to join yourself. Yeah, now you know how I think. That is the main, the main downside with this. Well, and I'll be streaming. You can literally see what I'm doing. You don't need to know how I think. You can literally watch me do whatever I do. <laughs> but you're not wrong. You you do know how I think now. This game is free. Yeah. And you don't need the puppy pack. I don't know if puppy pack is DLC, actually. But uh, you don't actually need it to um like play with me. Everyone can just play the, the pack I'm using. Yeah, no 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 screen watching. I'm worried about the um the archive version of this, me saying peanuts so often. It's gonna end in tears. It's gonna end in tears. Yeah, you can play in browser. I think if you hang on, let me just type something. There you go. If you wanna play the game or play on the browser version, go to that website.
Right, while people are joining, I will be right back. So, um, hold fire. But I will be back. So don't 64 people join suddenly, because otherwise I won't be here. I'll be like a minute, max. I'm back. I'm back. What are we up to? We're nearly up to 40 players. Are people still joining? Is it still going up? Or shall we just start? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, we got a dad joke redeemed. Also, thank you to dear Liam1 and Klep33. Very kind of you both. Uh, dad joke then. Since we're on the puppy pack, I got a dog one. How does a dog stop a VCR? Do any, actually, do you guys know what a VCR is? Like a tape player? It might be past a lot of your times. Anyway, it presses the pause button. Pause. Get it? It's a dog. Oh, oh Labrador got it. Of course you got it. You're a Labrador. Yeah, you... <laughs> <laughs> Lots of people like, I feel old now. I knew what it was. Can't believe Labrador got that of all the people. I'm glad I'm glad you guys are old. I had a um I had a t-shirt that I wore to work. Like on Fridays we got to like wear what we wanted to. Like the rest of the week it was like smart clothes, like shirts and stuff. But on a Friday, it was a uh, home clothes day, as they say. And um I wore this shirt that was like um it had like a like a VCR on it, had a floppy disk, had some other stuff, and it said like, I can't remember the exact words, but something like never forget or something. <laughs> All the apprentices, they were like, "What? Why is there a save button on your shirt? Like, what does that mean?" <laughs> they had no idea a floppy disk was actually a thing. They thought it was just a save icon. They didn't know like it originated from an actual physical thing. Man, I felt old. Explaining a t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Someone's posted it in chat. Floppy. It's a good name. They don't make... They don't name technology like they used to. Floppy desk. How old am I? Oh, Nifty. It's the Nifty sponsored question. He's, ask <laughs> He's asking how old am I? I'm 34. I'm, th I'm, I'm at the age where I can't remember my age. 34, I think. I might be 35. I'm pretty sure I'm 34. Right, 48 people. Good enough. Okay, what are we going with? Oh, do we go with pets again? I mean, not pets. Toys? I don't know. Um, I feel like extra attack. Bit of that. Yeah, sod it. Let's do, let's do, the, let's do the thing again. So, tennis ball or balloon? I think, I think balloon. Then cheeky roll and do I want any of those? Nah, don't think I do. Why does the beaver give attack now? So random. Oh, Paddy's barking. He's barking. All right, we're going to be the saucy sausages just in time. See, it's what chat wanted. I got you, Dan, but... 
Yeah, Pad's like barking at people outside. You can see people like walking past. Generally, they're like, they park outside the house and he's like, Oi, you're not allowed to park here, it's my house. Right, okay, two ducks. Ooh. Ooh, that's a loss. Oh, it isn't? Yeah, it is. <laughs> that is a loss. Not ideal. Um, oh, we can we can try and make our duck pretty buff. So we'll do that. We'll do that. I need another pet. I need another pet. We'll do. We'll just do another duck, shall we? It's going to be buff duck. I might freeze that for next time. And then, oh, do we go with the gecko again? I think I might, because then I can sell the ducks. Potentially. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. We'll see what, we'll see what happens. Uh, there's no custom rules, I don't think. It's just standard. Alright, come on, saucy sausages. What do we got? The magical noobs. Oh, I think we might be okay. Oh, no, he wiped our big duck. We're not okay. We are not okay. We got no stats at the back. Alright, tier 2 pets. And we gain one of our hearts back. Um, Okay, we got hench duck. So let's just double hench the duck. We'll do that. Start of turn, summon a level 1 mouse. What does that do? Oh, I'll tell you what, though. We'll do the puppy. We'll get the... Oh, shall we do oven mitts? Stock of free lasagna. Get the gecko in. And then I just want a flying squirrel. Whatever level that comes. So I'll shove you. What level is flying squirrel? Oh, it's next. It's turn three. Not ideal. I don't want to lose the missions. I think lasagna is pretty good. Two and three. Uh, we do have some more stats at the back now as well. And the duck should be pretty hench. So let's see... Oh, man. <laughs> oh, we get rid. Oh, we got to win. We got to win. Thank you, wavy tea bags. He waved his tea bags in surrender. That's what happened. Right, level up the duck. Oh, it wasn't what I wanted. It wasn't what I wanted. What does that do? Two, deal two damage. Oh, it's the first and last enemy. Uh, yes, please. Um, oh, do I want to level them up again? I probably should have sold the duck, to be honest. I don't think I want to level up either of those. I think I'm better off just rolling. Uh, faint. It's tier three, so it won't do anything. Um, let's give rice to maybe the duck. Because the duck is going to go. Because that's three coins. Oh, I... Quick, quick. What do I do? Freeze you. I don't know what it is. I just froze it. <laughs> I panicked. There's not enough time when you don't know the rules. The pets. Alright, so this thing should do damage to front and back enemies. Two and two, I think it was. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, I like that. There's the one that spawns the blooming dolphin thing. Dolphin with rice in its mouth. I think it's like sushi already or something. Is the dolphin sushi? Or is that... No, I'm thinking of tuna. Dolphin's mammal, right? So you can't... You can't do that. Um, anyway, we have a lasagna now. What are we going to keep here? If anything. Maybe that bird. So I think we give... We give the bird stats. I don't actually know if I want this thing. I mean, it's better than that right now. Oh, man, there's no time. There's no time to do anything. There's a squirrel. There's a squirrel. We don't even have a thing. Why did you just get the squirrel, Matt? No, what am I doing? Oh, I just froze it in time. Can I buy it? I can't buy it. Another roll. Freeze the squirrel. Oh, <laughs> there's not enough time. There's not enough time. Alright, the dizzy ponies. 
Oh, I am liking that thing. I think leveled up. It should be pretty nice. We've got our own dolphin at the back now. Decent. Yeah, there was literal panic then. Okay, so I want to get... I need I need another toy, basically. Big time. Sod it. I'm leveling this up. So you level that up. Oh, there's the, the chameleon thing. I need a toy. I just need a toy. So we'll keep that. Oh, another one of those. I mean, a lemur could give me some toys. Do I get rid of the duck? Yeah, let's get the toy. I think the toy's got to be worth it. I'll do the radio for some stats. And then... I don't actually want another flying squirrel, I don't think. Okay, we'll just do that for now. I'm going chameleon build this time, I think. I do, I rate the chameleon. So we're against the blue balls. The saucy sausages against the blue balls. Nice. Oh, does that do like more damage? I didn't actually see what the level up did. There must be custom rules on time because like this is flying. But yeah, we'll get rid of you. So we're going to get the radio back no matter what. But let's shove a chameleon out at front. We'll level that up. Then I don't actually know what I want. Oh, another chameleon. <laughs> I think you freeze that. Try and level this thing up. I think I want like better a better toy, essentially. So what does that do? Does four damage to the first and last enemy? That is not bad. I assume it will do six if I level it up all the way. Oh, I should have frozen the puppy. Oh, knob. Should have frozen the puppy because we're about to lose. Oh, it does come back. It does come back. I'd rather get like a higher tier because I think we're going up a tier this round. Are we? Oh, this guy has some stats going on. Can we get through that? No, we can't. Too many stats. They're on five and five. Blooming out. Right, okay, we'll shove the chameleon on. Um, Another one of those? I don't really... Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, Doberman needs to be lowest pet, which it isn't. Um, Buffalo. Nah, there's not enough time to read all these. Oh, there's the level three of that, mate. Right? Man, how is everyone else getting on? There's a lot of people with five, four. Oh, most people aren't doing that great, I guess. I think I'm like sort of in the middle. The trouble is the... Uh, the time's fast when you don't know the packs. Oh, they got the bird thing that I've got. All right, there's all sorts going on. I don't actually know what's going on. But can we... Oh, no better. <laughs> I was going to say, can we get to the end? No, we can't. I think what I want to do then, move that to the back. Right, so we level that up. Here we go, here we go. Tier 6 toy. So let's sell... Sell the moth. It's a bit terrible, isn't it? Then we'll get the tier 6 toy. Do we go with the television? Or do we go with the peanut jar? Maybe peanuts for everyone. Nah, go television. I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, give you a pie. Level you up. What else we got? I don't know. Freeze lasagna. I have no idea what I'm doing. Faint. I'm going to take... Oh, I wanted that. I wanted that. All right. Okay. No idea what's going to go on here. What does the pie thing do? I didn't even see. <laughs> I was like, mm, pie. I like pie. Oh, okay. We're good. We're good. We got to win. We got to win. We needed that. 
We definitely needed that. Let's level you up. Might give you a lemon as well. It's not bad. Um, probably sell the mongoose. Probably for a poodle. Are these all... Oh, that's not great. It's not great. Uh, I'll freeze poodle. See if we can get anything better. I mean, that could be good. Leveling you up. I mean, we get a tier, a tier 6, won't we? Maybe we'll do that next time. What else we got? Panther. Oh, perk's two times stronger. Sod it. We'll just get Poodle. Shove you at the back. We'll get that next time. And then a decent tier 6, hopefully. That is the plan. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I have no time to think. I right, just finished him. Uh, Infra. I loved Infra. Probably one of my favorite games I've played on the channel. Especially the first episode. It was like so fun. Like, oh, look at that. Look at that bird go. Oh, oh, that's just about a win. That was tight. Right, okay. Tier six. Tier six pets. Thank you for the sub. Who is it? Mike Bro D, thank you very much. All right, we'll level this thing up. What do we take? Oh, could buy lots of food. Could gain perks on that. Um, I'm tempted not to go with either, to be honest. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna roll. Oh, there's a puma. I gotta do it again. <laughs> I may want that thing as well. I might freeze it. I don't know what it does. I'll have to read next time. Oh, I've, I've... It's so quick. I've still got three coins left. I must go faster. Yeah, I've got to stop looking at chat. All right, here we go then. What are we doing? What are we doing? Okay, stats for all. Puma massively helping me out there. Decent. Another win. Another win. Oh, I can level up the chameleon. I think we do that, don't we? But, oh, another puma. Yes. Do I... Yeah, I think we do that. I think we do that. Can I even get a lionfish involved? I think I just got a stick. Unless I sell that thing. That probably saves my butt, though. I think I'll do one more roll. I may be better off just lasagnaing that for now. I think I do want some lionfish. Deal four damage to one random enemy. Is We're just going to have to give it loads of attack. And I'm not entirely sure how to do that. Although television and puma will help. Who's being ignored? How am I ignoring you? What did you ask? I don't know. I can't. I don't have time to look at chat. There's too much going. Oh, we got to win. We got to win. I can look at chat. I'm smashing this. Easy. All right, okay. Okay. What are we doing here? So television that gives everyone fat stats. That's the trouble though. If if I keep this, it's just going to keep getting stats. Then I won't want to get rid of it. I got to get rid of it now. It's gone. All right. So you go in. I feel like I want that sort of at the start. If I give it pie, it'll get four attack. So it will hit twice. And then I just want to keep leveling it up, I think. I mean, I could give it a croissant, but whatever. Okay, nothing good. We actually did our turn that time, sort of, nearly. I feel like it's time to get better food on these now. All right, here we go. Oh, they got chameleon. Che oh, they got stinky sock. What does that do? Reduces the highest health. Oh, you cheeky bugger. Thankfully, I think I got the win. Yes. We saw a bit of the lionfish working there, by the way. 
Oh, there's Pima. There it is. There it is. Oh, there's another lionfish. There it is. There's another lionfish. There it is. <laughs> oh, well, that, that thing, thing that go well, everyone. Um, Yeah, I think we just wait for chocolate. Oh, hurry up, everyone. You're taking ages. Come on, guys. Jeez, what are you doing? Got to wait 20 seconds for this. Oh, I could sort the lionfish. That is a shout. That is a shout. How are only two people are out? No, there's a lot more than two people out. <laughs> a lot more. There's one person with like, like they're like secretly a pro or something. They have not lost yet. I hope I don't come against them. All right, what have we got here? Ow. Thankfully, we are smashing through. He's going to do some damage to us, though. Only six. We're good. We're good. Oh, stats for days. Love it. Um, I think we just keep trying to get chocolate. Or shall I... Shall I pancake you? Move you forward one. Um, yeah, then I'm just trying to level up what I've got, basically. Apart from the squirrel. I mean, there's more pancakes. That's another... That's more stats in it. May as well. May as well. Oh, the new, my new video is live. M. Boyetta, cheers for the cheer. And cheers for reminding me and everyone. Which means this is probably going to be a short stream. I will probably be ending after this one. So let's hope I can get far. Oh, what have they got at the start? It's only when it faints, right? Ow, it did damage. I think the lemon saved us. Okay. Oh, the lemon. Oh, the lemon is so good. Okay, the lemon saved our butt then. Oh, I asked a polybridge video today as well. All right, so that's only got 17 attack. So it does sort of need the pipe. But then, hang on, what sort of tier pets does everyone have? Most are below six. Yeah, so I'm, do I'm doing that. I'm doing that because that's that's tier six. That's going to do some damage. Um, another Pima at the back. Why not? Uh, chocolate, freeze that. And that's pretty much it. Right, here we go then. Saucy sausages. The bumbling turtles. Okay, so I did 59 damage. <laughs> I had minus 59 health at the start there. Oh, I feel like we're pretty strong, though. We are pretty strong. That's the closest anyone's got. I just wiped them out. Sorry about that. All right, stats for everyone. It may be melon time. Oh, actually, let's level this up. Oh, another one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's level three now. That's good. Is it worth... I think I melon the front one, right? It's better to get another hit out of them, I think. Pretty sure. I could sort the puma as well. I don't know. I feel like lemons might be better. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm overthinking now. Have I played 3D Bridge games? Is that the name of the game? I've never heard of it. Oh, what's that? They got eggs. Oh, they're all level threes, they are. Blimey. Still, they got rinsed by us. Damn. Oh, we're actually good. We're in the top six or something. Top six-ish. Right, okay, I need good food. Do we go lemon at the back? I think we do. And then, oh, another puma. 
Oh, and another chocolate. Okay, Puma's getting leveled up next time. Banging. Three D bridge games. No, I have to look at that. Is it about building a bridge? I imagine not. It might be. PewDiePie did a video on. I'll have a look. Oh, it's about building bridge in three D. Nice. I'll definitely check that out. There's not any like three D bridge building games, which is weird. By the way, thanks, new rad. If I didn't say thank you earlier, I've only just sort of noticed. Right. They got stats. I got stats. They have melons at the back, but I got rid of them. Oh, that is a win. That is a win. And I'm in, I'm in the top five, I think. Everyone gets stats. I level up the Puma. So we're going to get fat stats at the start. Okay, this is good. This is actually good. So what does that do? Repeat its ability as level three. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> um, I might just lasagna you. And then I guess we just leave it like this. I could take lemon over the pancakes on that. Because I feel like we're going to be like maxed out pretty soon. But yeah, this could be it. I could actually win a blooming versus for a change. I'm getting cocky. I'm getting cocky. Do I have two lives? Am I allowed to be cocky? The boring bananas. Oh dear. They have stats. I think we're in trouble here. I think we're in trouble. Ow. Oh. Oh, it's a draw. It's a draw. <laughs> oh, it's between... Oh, it's between three of us. Okay, so I think we need to do that. I need to level up these guys first fast um oh, i don't even know how to level them up oh i could get another chameleon if i can level up the chameleon that is way more stats right there you go chameleon will be leveled up next time i've got at least one more round so i'm going to get another eight 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 and eight on everyone is it which should max out quite a few. Because it would, remember, it does it again in the game. I don't know. We'll have to see what happens. So, what do we. When the gecko goes down, what do we have? So, most people are. Yeah, high 40s. So, we should be 50 50s next round. And if we win. That's even better. Nice. Okay, that's good. That's good. It's down to me and Scorky now. Come on, Matt. Come on, Matt. Let's level up this gecko. And then that should get a lot of people up to 40 and 40. I mean, 50 and 50, I think. Um, I think I just roll for better food. I don't know what food I actually want to go for. I could table sort the puma. Or I could try and lemon something. I think the salt could win it for me. I don't actually know. I could replace salt, but I feel like salt will like rip through melon, right? So yeah, we've we got 50 damage on most of our stuff. Oh, it's a win. It's a win. Okay, we just got to do that again. We just got to do that again. <laughs> okay, I don't need table sort. I think we leave everything as it is. Just try and add stats. So which one didn't have 50 health? I imagine you didn't. Oh, I probably shouldn't have given it to the lionfish thing. We got a lemon there. Yeah, 50 is the max. Won't go higher than that. Oh, we got nothing. We got nothing this round. That was terrible. Okay, let's see what happens. I can't, <laughs> I can't believe all I did that round was use a single apple. I feel like their team's definitely been switched around. 
Can we? I think we got it. I think we got it. GG's, Scorky. But uh, I got a win. It's the first time I've won on stream in like years. Oh. And it means that's probably a good place to end as well. Cheers for playing, guys. That was really fun. Uh, the addiction is back with a vengeance. Um, Smashy, question before I go. Who was your favorite YouTuber when you were younger? Well, when I was younger, YouTube didn't exist. We like had to go outside and stuff. Um, but when YouTube did exist, I guess my like inspirations for starting my own channels were probably like Graystool Plays, Let's Game It Out. They were like the two that like I really wanted to like try and do content like. Um, but then I also watched a lot of like Blitz and Dre. And so like when I started my YouTube, I wanted to be like sort of between those two. Because I was like, Graceful Plays and Let's Game Out do like crazy stuff. Dre and Blitz do like lots of variety. So I was like, if I can do somewhere in the middle, that would be banging. And I feel like that's sort of where I am. Like a lot of my videos, like they're quite variety-ish. That's a word. And uh, sometimes I go a little bit, a little bit joshy when I'm playing. But yeah. Um, Mike Bro D, cheers for the cheer. Very kind of you. But yeah, go watch my video now. It's another Polybridge one. It's a banger. Um, but yeah, peace, love, and super pets. They're back and they're addicted, and that's what we're gonna do for us the evening. Bye.